Medina, good win today and a good performance too. You said in the week, not bothered as long as you're in a hat for the next round, but you did get the win and the performance today, didn't you? Yeah, I thought we were uh, solid defensively. Um, and it was a tricky toy for us, really. Uh, so they're an ambitious club, well managed. And they've got some really good players, lots of ability. Um, but I thought we were very good in the sense of we showed character uh, when we were 2 0 up, really in cruise control. And then they scored an unbelievable goal. Obviously, missed the penalty goal, Trina, as well. But we showed good character to go and get another opportunity by winning the penalty and asking questions of the opposition defensively from restarts. And uh, it killed the game off, really. But yeah, really pleased with the victory. And I'm more delighted than into the half of the next round. And they, say, start that second half, we rode some pressure really well from them, didn't they? They, they come out very strong. Yeah, we expected that. The good side. Uh, I don't think they've lost many goals, uh, many games by two goals as well. If you actually look at their games, and they haven't lost many games, so they're a good side. I know they've lost some of their key players, and they only had four subs tonight, but they still got a lot of ability and they're well managed. And you managed to get 90 minutes out of Josh Meekins today as well. He's very solid at the back, but also won two penalties up the other end as well. Yeah, completes his runs. Uh, Josh is a very professional player, uh, a lot of experience. It's probably what we were crying out for over the last few weeks, and we're delighted to have him. He had a really good debut. And it's Darlington in the next round away. Uh, Draw's been kind with us with a nice long trip. Um, what do you make of them? Have you had a chance to have a look at them since the draw? Was it just get tonight done? I haven't even looked at it. I didn't even know really to look after the ground today. Um, and everyone was sort of saying it's there and if we win tonight, but we had to focus on tonight. It's, there's no point. And the next focus for us is to debrief tonight, uh, see how we can improve, and uh, focus from Thursday, sort of Wednesday, Thursday, on all the shot of the weekend. And yes, yeah, so we've got all the shot visit near Saturday. Very experienced season team at this level. What do you expect from them? They're going to be a tough game. There's no easy games in the division. Uh, like tonight was a tough game. You know, really lost to the sport into the United League. So there's no doubt they're going to go close this year. They're in a very demanding position. But all the sort of good side. Uh, well managed again. Well coached. Some good players. And it'll be a tough test. And so there was some rumours circulating tonight. I don't know if you've had time to check or look about the league and the, the future of clubs that the Department for Sport and Culture and Media didn't, don't want to give club grants anymore. They want National League clubs living off loans for the rest of the season. Do you think that puts the season in danger? Certain, certainly for a club like us and many, many other clubs at this level. It's, it's all rumours at the it. moment. Yeah, yeah. well, I, I forced, you've just mentioned it's the first I've heard of it. Really, it's not in my jurisdiction. I think when it comes to the boards and chairmen and, and people that do all the paperwork, that's for them guys. But... You know, we can only focus on one game at a time, one training session at a time, and that's how we continue to work. We're very lucky to be playing football. I think that's very important. There's a lot of leagues that aren't playing football and clubs where the stadiums are just derelict. They've got no opportunity to play. So we're blessed we're able to play football and we're under that elite captain. Was it good to get a win tonight as well, to get that sort of confidence back? Because I think, this, I think the last win was in the FA Trophy before, wasn't it? Yeah, I think we've lost two uh, in our last four games. I think if you actually look yeah, at the last yeah, six or seven games, games yeah. yeah, look, we went to Hartlepool, obviously just come out of uh, our isolation. Uh, Maidenhead away, if you actually look at the game itself, I think we had more attempts on their goal than, uh, than they did. But look, it was down to the scoreline, they won 4 0. They were poor, really poor goals defensively. Uh, individual errors cost them that day. So, look, it's such a tough division. If you look, I think we won six, drew three, and lost seven. Is that right? So, it's a. It's a mishmash of a season, really, for us so far. But we look, look, we want to keep improving. Players are giving everything, showing the character togetherness, and uh, we've got some good ability within the group as well. Uh, we've got a couple of uh, niggles tonight. You know, Mo's a little bit tired, a little bit leggy. He was in walk all day today. Uh, Alex Doyle, obviously, he had um, he had COVID, so he was a little bit tired uh, as the game went on. And then he picked up a knock on his ankle, sort of his shin area. So we'll see how that is. So we just got to focus on one game at a time. That's all we can do. Yeah, and so. Again, positive for Saturday. Do you think the league table is a bit of a false economy at the moment with teams having played, some teams playing very little games and some teams playing a lot of games? Yeah, it is. Yeah, um, I wouldn't say it's false, but what I would say is, is from our point of view, we've played is it 16, 17 games. We've got we're on 17 now. Yeah. It's a 17, we've got yeah. 21 points, you know. Realistically, we, we would have liked a few more points. I think our performance is deser deserved, but the, uh, the level's relentless, it's rootless. Um, so we've just got to make sure that we're focused. Uh, on everything we do, and you know, what we want to do is get to 50 points as quick as possible, and then see where see what kind of impact we can really make on the division over 44 games. Um, we've made a good impact, and it's been stop start lately, and it's like that for a lot of clubs. If you look at the over situation, it's a nightmare situation. Mm -hmm. I was talking to Luke Garage the other day about about their situation. They're Saturday, Tuesday, all the way through to the end of March. So it is what it is. We'd rather be playing games than training, so we've got to embrace it and uh, and take it on.